Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It's Jackie, and today I'll be showing you some of my April favorites. So starting off, I've been really into the Y2K like claw clip look. So I have a few favorite ones here to show you. First off, I have this really neutral cutout one. It's just a really basic like claw clip. And then I have a slightly bigger one. This is I think like resin, um, but it's also in this like really pretty beige like neutral color. And this one actually has like two set of teeth. So this holds my hair better. But I do like the first cutout one for like a little like half up do you know what I'm saying and then the last one that I have here is this like really really pretty like clear acrylic gold flakes one um I got this at the mall and like it is huge and I don't really have that much hair so this doesn't really hold my hair as well but I just really like how it's clear and it just looks so bougie and then onto some beauty favorites I've been really loving this Tarte cream bronzer this is from their like surfer collection they have the same packaging as my surfer curl mascara which is my holy holy grail I rave about it in every single beauty video and they have this like really pretty cream bronzer i've been opting for more cream products because it just wears better under the mask and i've been really loving this one it's so creamy it's not too orangey on me and i just love how it's compact i think this is the travel size but there's a lot of product in here and a little goes such a long way and then onto my favorite blush at the moment it is this one from she glam it is their liquid blush i have it in the shade 104 Dolce Vita and I've actually reviewed this on my channel before but it comes in a weird applicator it's like a spongy thing and when I say liquid it's like really really liquidy it pours out of the container so you must be pretty careful with that but this is such a beautiful mauve shade on me and it has some slight shimmers but yeah I'll be happy to do another video reviewing Shein's makeup line because they're just really really good and like super affordable now one of my skincare favorites is this one by Innisfree. It is their Youth Enriched Cream with Orchid. I actually don't like the scent of this but this gives you like the most hydration I've ever like tried in a cream and if you know me I get like dry patches like right around my cheek area and like right in this like a little crease around my nose and those have been my problematic areas for like the longest time but this cream actually helps wonders. I put it on before I go to bed and I usually put on like a little bit right before makeup and it goes on so so smoothly. I highly recommend this. Another thing that I've been getting like really into lately is eye patches, under eye patches. I just finished my Pixie Beauty one so I just picked up this other one from Amazon. This is the Rosella Tea eye gel patch and this really smells like rose this part is actually pretty interesting because every eye patch has like bits of rose petals in it I just usually keep this in a fridge so it's like nice and cool i put it on before bed and then sometimes on my days off i'll put it on in the morning to just kind of depuff my eye bag situation but yeah if you like this i'll leave a link down below not sponsored i just really really enjoy this and then onto my most favorite item in the beauty category i have my new holy grail perfume this one is by dossier it is their scent and floral pear and this is inspired by jo malone's paraphrasia i think it was called but this just smells so so good and i have a whole separate video on this brand before but yeah I just been loving this one so so much now finally into the fashion portion of the video one thing that I've been really drawn to lately is the color navy I really enjoy my navy top this navy sweater has been in my work wardrobe rotation for like the past few weeks now and I just really love how like simple it is but you could really dress it up for work and stuff it is this really like basic ribbed sweater and it's not cropped it hits me like in the hips area so it's like perfect for work i just love how navy looks on my skin tone i feel like navy is just a flattering color on anybody another navy top that i've been like really in love with lately is this really really thick one by H&M um it's a really like simple v-neck ribs and this is actually thicker than the first one so I would wear this on colder days but it's just like really simple I have done a haul and a lookbook with this sweater before so be sure to check that out I just really love the colors 
navy just looks so so good i can't stress that enough it looks really simple like with a blazer on top some jeans so you have like a really casual outfit and then following that whole workwear vibe i do have this really out of my comfort zone jacket i say it's out of my comfort zone because i usually don't pick up stuff like this but i have this beige well it's kind of hard to tell but i have this beige jacket from h&m as well it has a belt tie and then it is kind of like a collared jacket it is pretty structured which is why it's like way out of my comfort zone because i actually don't go for stuff like this but i feel like this just dresses up like an outfit so so well i remember wearing it my first few days at work and my coworker was like where are you going and yeah it just like looks so flattering on it makes any outfit like more put together people start to take you more seriously when you dress better so um that's been my vibe lately and if you know me my videos are not complete without jeans and so i'm just gonna speak about like one of my favorite pairs this one is a pair of mom jeans from shein and surprisingly these fit me so so well i actually got it in like a much larger size it's a size 26 the waist is a little loose but everything else just fits so so well and like it hits me at the ankle surprisingly because i'm five three and a half so jeans are usually a little long on me they're like the perfect amount of bagginess it's just really really nice and comfortable and i've just been loving these a lot now moving into a more casual wear um i have been loving this jogger set from blush mark it comes with a gray sweater and then we have gray joggers that match um i've already spoken about these before in a haul so that'll be linked down below as well they're the softest thing on the inside and they're actually really really thick i just love sets like these because you wear them together you can wear them separately and you just have a lot more options and last but not least we're gonna get into accessories really quick i know i've mentioned this bag before in a like not so positive tone but i've been loving this jw payback surprisingly i know in my like black friday haul i said it's too boxy it doesn't fit as much but I just find that it's such a cute little like detail to your outfit. I love the box in this. I just wish it's a little bigger. It's not as practical, but I do like love to wear it crossbody. It just adds like a little, you know, like maturity to your outfit. So I usually wear this with like the beige jacket or sometimes I wear this with laser like a workwear outfit and it just looks so put together. You could wear it as a shoulder bag or you could wear it as a crossbody by elongating the shop so that's it for today's video thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next one